warm welcome to journey another day with Jesus into your promised land knowing his will and submitting to his voice Greetings in Jesus name welcome to this beautiful new morning welcome to this beautiful new opportunity to reproduce to multiply to bear fruit for the name of the Lord wherever you are today will you trust in the grace that is working in you and through you this season is special every time the word of God comes into our spirit we are able to conceive a fruit we are able to reproduce on behalf of God we are able to give birth to a divine assignment a divine project here on the earth i declare fruitfulness to increase and abound in your life in your relationships in your marriage in your career in your businesses in your finances in your traveling in your ministry everything let it be fruitful and let it overflow with fruitfulness let little fruit multiply and become much more fruit let me read the scripture for you this is isaiah chapter 4 and verse 2 the lord says but at that time there is always a specific time for fruitfulness fruits don't appear on the tree on random days and random times there is a specific season that is set apart for certain fruits to appear for certain results to come forth so the lord says but at that time so i am prophesying this over a church a church a bride that understands the timings and the seasons of the lord that understands the correct occasions the right time to reproduce what god is speaking to reproduce what god is doing to reproduce the ways and the manners of god the lord says but at that time the branch of the lord will be attractive and glorious the second requirement for us to reproduce for the lord or to bear fruit for god is that we will be the branch of the lord if we are not part of this main wine main grape wine jesus said it like this in john chapter 15 verse 1 i am the wine and you are the branches so if we are not connected to the main wine if we are not a branch of the lord if we are not an extension of who god is then we can never bear fruit for god we may be successful we may be productive we may be effective with whatever we are doing we may have great and exemplary lifestyles people may even look up to you and yet we may not be the extension of the lord we may not be the branch of the lord for us to truly be fruitful unto the lord we need to become the branch of the lord going back to the scripture isaiah 4 verse 2 but at that time the branch of the lord will be attractive and it will be glorious wherever you are i declare may you be attractive today may you be glorious today may everything that you do may it attract magnetically attract people to the lord to the lord's purposes to the lord's ways to the lord's manners to the lord's will to the lord's ways in jesus name and may everything that you do and everything that you are may it be glorious may there be testimonies may there be stories and reports that are brought to you that this incident that this person or this occasion it is so beautiful outside and on the inside both that there is a specific glory attached to everything that you do the season for being normal and ordinary is past it is gone you are supposed to live a glorious life because you're the branch of the lord because you're an extension of the vine you are going to be attractive 
and you are going to be glorious it says the fruit the land produces it will be now the pride and the glory of the survivors who are left in israel this is indeed the year of the promised land however we need to remember that this land it also produces fruit if the land is barren if the land is empty then it is not going to be effective it is not going to be useful for us but the lord is saying this day this time that the lord has given you you are going to be a branch of the lord because of which you will be attractive and you will be glorious and the land where the lord is planting you the land where the lord is giving you in that land you are now going to produce fruit and this fruit it will become pride and it will become the glory of all the survivors in this land all the people that are depending on the land i pray today that your fruit will become the pride and the glory of those who are dependent on you there is a generation that is rising up there is a group of people that are rising up that are generals of the lord that are rising up and they are looking up to you for solutions and answers and help may the fruit that you produce be a pride be the glory for the sake of those survivors in the land there are still a remnant that the lord has chosen that the lord is speaking to and the lord is using in these last days So are you listening to me church the lord says at the right time the branch of the lord will be attractive and glorious receive that in jesus name and the fruit in the land that this branch produces it will be the pride and it will be the glory of the survivors who are left in israel may your fruit become the pride and the glory for all those survivors Father we thank you for this word it is just at the right time we receive this blessing we receive this grace we believe that everything that we touch today will produce fruit because we are the branch of the lord and the fruit it is going to be a pride and it is going to be a glory we thank you lord for your making us attractive and you're making us glorious in jesus name we pray amen thank you for listening Hope today's word will encourage you and build you for the day ahead. God bless you and shalom.